Franklin Burner was just six years old when her father, U.S. Army Sergeant John Franklin Burner III, was killed while serving in Iraq in 2010. His physical absence is the reason she started the Gold Star Family Organization at Augusta University, and she's joining us here in the mixed studios today to tell us more about the group. Uh, hey, Caitlin. Hi. Thanks for joining us. <laughs> Thank Appreciate you. It. Thank you for coming. Uh, let's, let's start with the big question here. What exactly is a Gold Star Family, and uh, why did you start the club at AU? Yeah, so a Gold Star family is the title given to those who have lost an immediate family member in the military. And I started this organization at AU because I lost my father, active duty army, as you said, when I was six. And it really motivated me to also find other people in my community that were like me and no better place than to do that at AU, which is very inclusive and open to me starting this organization. And um, yeah, I've already got to meet two other Gold Star children at my university, and it's been great. Great. So what, what sort of goals do you have with the club? So goal-wise, one of our main goals is to educate and raise awareness on what a Gold Star family is and to also fundraise for the Children of Fallen Patriots Foundation, who helps put children like me through college. Now, uh, you're going to be at the AU basketball games at Christenberry uh, Fieldhouse on Saturday. Um, so what's the main purpose there? The main purpose is to fundraise for the Children of Fallen Patriots Foundation during that event and also just to educate, like I said, it's very important for people in my community, in my opinion, to know what a Gold Star family oh, is. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, AU has been designated as a military-friendly school. Mm -hmm. So has that made it easier to get more people interested in the club? Connection-wise with staff, it makes it easier to send out information and try to get more participation, but not necessarily student-wise. It's actually been very difficult to get some participation. Um, that's why exposure like this helps. Um, hopefully we can get more participants. You don't have to be Gold Star family related to be in the organization, just a passion to educate and raise awareness on what a Gold Star family is. Uh, in terms of Gold Star family and, and let's say your family in particular, uh, you were, th you were that age, that young age, mm -hmm. when you lost your father. Uh, growing up and, and, and knowing the importance of what he did, and we thank him for his service, uh, how did that kind of start all this for you? Um, honestly, it, it built a drive in me, um, not necessarily just with this organization, but with everything in general. Um, he sacrificed his life for our country, and that can't be matched in my opinion. Um, so it just gave me a drive to work hard and do great in everything I do. Okay, okay so um, you are a kin kinesiology major, <laughs> right, at AU. So uh, tell us, um, what are your plans for after you graduate? So after I graduate, I hope to apply to AU's PA school program and attend PA school there. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Right. Okay. And so what are, what are your hopes here for the Gold Star family all moving on into the future? Moving on, I hope we get more participation, and I hope that a lot of people in my community know what a Gold Star family is and that they can be able to tell someone else what a Gold Star family is, and I hope to fundraise a lot of money for the Children of Fallen Patriots Foundation. And speaking of the fundraiser, again, that's going to be happening at Chris and Barry Fieldhouse this Saturday with the AU basketball game. Caitlin will be there. And what, what's the time there for that? It is 1.30 for the women's game and 3.30 for the men's. Mm -hmm. All right. Be sure you check that out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And if you would like to donate, right. the website there is uh, on the screen as well. Caitlin, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you today. so much thank for having you. me. Yes. And congratulations on this. Thank yeah. you. Mm -hmm. <laughs>